So, <clears throat> the longer that you retain on this journey, the deeper of a spiritual awakening you are going to go through. Now, I'm going to talk to you guys about a lot in today's video. And I embrace when God has me in solitude. Because I get to do a lot of deep thinking and a lot of self-realization. Now, shout out to everybody that's been retaining their seed. I know that you are going through plenty of spiritual awakenings. You're doing plenty of shadow work and you're learning how to become the best version of yourself. I also want to say shout out to all of the returning supporters, all of the people that's been rocking out with me since day one and all of the new supporters on the channel. Now, when I do have these deep thoughts, I think about life from a broader perspective. I think about the way that this system is designed, it's created. I think about all the things, not all of them, obviously, but some of the things that's been taught to me. And sometimes you do feel like it's a constant hamster wheel. And everybody is basically working just to survive, to live, to pay bills. It is so crazy to me because the system itself is created by humans. It's man-made. It's a construct. And ever since we were young, they we used to get asked this question a lot. What do you want to be when you grow up? So when you were younger, you had all of these aspirations, right? All of these things that you wanted to do. When I was younger, I wanted to go to the NBA. Obviously, that ain't work out. And now, at the age of 30, I stay connected with my inner child. I'm living out one of the things that I always wanted to do, which was to create a YouTube channel and be able to express myself, especially the fact that people used to make fun of me with my voice. People used to make fun of me. I've also created eBooks because I love to write. And trying my very best to not let the system take away from my imagination. Because the system is designed for you to constantly work and work and work and work and work and you only get one vessel. We only get one shot at life, bruh. And no matter how much money your job may pay you, you are worth more than that because your time is the number one asset. So when jobs are paying like $10 an hour, $12 an hour, $15 an hour, and then you're living expenses because obviously people pay rent, you pay for your phone bill, you pay for whatever. The system is really designed for people to just 
Okay, bye. But it's not designed for you to succeed as much as you really, really want to because you just think that what my job pays me is what I am worth. But you see, this journey taught me how to use my imagination to learn how to see through a lot of things in this matrix. Now, the only hope that you have to, outside of running a business, right? Outside of running a business, whatever, okay? The only real hope that you had to get further financially is to purchase assets. It is to own real estate in the stock market. It is to create cash flow because who, bro, when I be outdoors and I be seeing people that be in their 70s and 80s and 90s, well, I don't know about 90s, I might be exaggerating, but like their 60s, excuse me, 60s and 70s and 80s and they're still working. I'm like, dang. And I'm not sitting there saying, oh, don't work, don't get a job. Nah, bro, we all need a source of income. But it's the way that the system is designed. Because once again, you make money. You make money to then give it back to the system, which is putting it into the bills or putting it into things that you have to take care of. And I'm not complaining. I'm just venting and expressing myself. So for anybody that's watching this video thinking that I'm complaining, I'm going to need you to do some more like deeper thinking and learn how to open your mind. This is a rat race. And then they distract you with entertainment. They created TVs, right? Y'all see, I don't have a TV. But they created TVs to keep you entertained and to keep you... You, you you get that little dopamine, that little, oh, I get to relax and watch my TV. I get to watch football on Sundays. I get to watch wrestling on Mondays. Whatever days that stuff come on. Constantly entertained, but yet, you're not thinking. I sit there and I ask myself a lot of different questions, bro. Because you have to question everything in this human experience. They also keep you distracted with endless amounts of PMO because that is your, your your dopamine for the day. You get that release and you you just feel how you feel. Ugh, I, I, all my problems are solved because I released my seed. No, it's not. The number one thing that we have to learn how to keep embraced within us is our imagination, our inner child, and having a mindset of creation and abundance because the purpose of a job no matter what job it is is to take your energy take your inner chi bro the inner chi is the kundalini is the creativity within but the job's responsibility is to keep you in this fucking cycle Jobs can pay way more money, way more income if they decided to. Because money is man-made. And yes, we need it. It is very important. Super important. I just don't like the way that the system is designed. And I have free will to express myself, and so do you. And I get it. Maybe, of course, I, I might sit there and say, well, what are you going to do about it? Oh, blah, blah, blah. Whatever. I don't care, bro. It's just me expressing myself. Because this retention journey makes me do a lot of shadow work. It makes me do a lot of internal work. It makes me face myself. You, you, you understand what I'm saying. It makes me come to some deep realizations that, bro... 
the main thing that we have to do is invest so that you buy back your time so that you get more time to yourself you you feel me life is just not about working to just pay bills and let me just work to just make sure i'm just just getting by i'm just surviving no how many people on the face of this earth are in survival mode when you're in a video game when you're playing a video game and you're in survival mode you're you're not even focused on creating and get into each level you're just focusing on surviving it's the same thing with life. God put us on this planet to plant great seeds so that we can flourish. It's all about trying to figure it out at the end of the day. My higher self is with me at all times. My higher self is guiding me. My higher self is protecting me. My higher self is teaching me a lot about myself. And I go to God for the answers. Because I know that I can't do all of this by myself. No, it's God and me. Point blank, period. You feel me? The box is a cycle that the system likes to keep people in. Your, your 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 main focus and your main job is to think outside of the box. I just want to express myself. All right, thank you to everybody that's been supporting the channel. If you're new, subscribe. Join the Telegram chat. Join the Discord chat. Leave your comments below, and if you want to give the video a thumbs up, it's up to you. I love y'all. I appreciate y'all. It's your boy Terrence Carter. TC Talks. TC Fitness. Yes, sir.